what do you mean when you talk about uh, the, and write about the, the Russian soul and, and how has it changed I in the last few centuries? Uh, of course, uh, Russian soul now is mostly a metaphor, right? So when I say Russian soul means Russian character or Russian mentality. But still, there is, in Russians there is kind of soul. Why we say soul? Because, you know, here in, uh, in Europe, you like to be rationalist. We are not so rationalist. And when you are not rationalist, you are a little bit irrationalist. The meaning of soul is coming up and say hello. You know, that's why soul is so real if we speak about Russians. We had terrible uh, changes with the Russian soul because during one century, the Russian soul changed two times radically. First of all, during the revolution of 1917, the uh, original historical values went down. Bolsheviks came, communism started, and uh, the Soviet Union had completely different values, as everybody knows. Then the Soviet Union stopped in, in its uh, existence, and again, it was like a titanic catastrophe. The whole big Russian people, they lost their they, they even lost their mentality. That was, it, was a men, it was a mental and it was uh, a moral crisis. And still now, the oh, Russian soul is looking for its identity. Is Russia a European country, in your opinion, or more of an Asian country? Um, I'll give you an example. When I go from Moscow to Strasbourg, my uh, friends know that I go to Europe. When I go from Moscow to Pekin or Tokyo, my, my, my wife said, you go to Asia. I know where I go, I don't know from where I go. Moscow is a, a point zero, so with its own uh, history, its own mentality. And here in Europe, some people believe that it is a big room, probably not very clean, but a big room in a, a European house. Uh, do you think that Canadians are Europeans? No, but still they have a lot of uh, connection with Euro Europe. The same with Russia, the same. Is the balance changing though between Asia and Europe in Russia in the same way that in the United States it's changing between Hispanics and the, 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 other, the other groups? One a foreigner asked me what do Russians think about I know that this foreigner do not, uh, doesn't understand Russia because all of us, we are different. And we are so different that we even cannot say that we are, uh, in Asia we are thinking this way. I mean, we are Asian, but in, in, because in Siberia we have also different uh, uh, mentalities and so on and so on. The, the thing is that culturally we are very close to it. means we are part of you, culturally. Politically, uh, historically, and uh, in a mental way, we are between uh, Europe and ourselves. It is like this. It, it goes. And uh, that's why I'm here. I want, I want to tell people that don't be too ero uh, Eurocentrist speaking about Russia. Then you wouldn't understand what does mean Russia. But we need especially today with all these terrorisms and so we need to have understanding beyond our government, be, beyond our um, the difficulties because you know in five, ten years Europe without Russia, Russia without Europe, it will be very difficult to exist. In your opinion, what should the role be of the rest of Europe towards Russia and with Russia? I think that what you need is to understand better Russia. I think in Russia we understand better Europe than uh, Europe understands Russia. Uh, and what, uh, practically what we need, we need to just to finish with visas, because this is silly. All the bandits, all prostitutes in, uh, from Russia are here. And just middle class people and students, they can come, and this is a humiliating practice. And then Russians do the same, and this is humiliating for Europe. And you know, I must tell you that uh, this is ridiculous because 
uh, these uh, give um, uh, um, reason for our nationalism to say that Europe doesn't like you, 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 European Russians. And uh, I think we, we have to stop it. We have to stop this practice. Finally, are you optimistic or pessimistic about the future of Russia uh, within Europe? It is so easy to be a pessimist in Russia, so I, I prefer to be optimist.